Welcome back, beer tubers. Time to take a look at another beer from Clown Shoes. This is Porcine Yoon Dragon, their 12.5% barrel aged Imperial Stout. Uh, this one was aged in bourbon barrels. And the base beer of this is, is Vampire Slayer, which I haven't had. And that is their Imperial Stout where they uh, use Beechwood smoked malt. So that's like the Roush style malt. So it's going to be nice and smoky. And hopefully this one's smoky and bourbony. Poured out very black. Initially poured out half a finger of a <clears throat> pretty light brown head on the beer. A lot of legs to the glass. Um, let's get the aroma. Yeah, it's got um, it's got a lot of sweetness, bourbon character, and some smokiness. Definitely picking up the Roush smell. It's got this meaty kind of bacony campfire smell. Some bourbon coming through. Nice caramel, bourbony, a little bit of vanilla. Um, no alcohol in the nose. They did they do bottle date their beers, and this was bottled back in October, so. It does have some age on it. There's some really dark roastiness to the beer, like a, almost like a burnt coffee character. Uh, not a whole lot of chocolate I'm getting on the nose right now. Hopefully more comes out in the flavor. Some nice sweet bread as well. So let's dive in. Cheers. Hmm, that's nice. Um, good complexity to it. The beer changed quite a bit on your tongue, first sip. You know, I'm feeling a little bit of that heat and taste a tiny bit, but it's pretty mellowed out. But uh, a beer like this, you kind of want it to have a little bit of a kick in there. Just kind of remind you how big of a beer it really is. Up front, you get a lot of sweetness, big caramel notes, and uh, sweet bread, very present. And then it starts to transition into this, this sort of nutty, uh, like, coconut character um, but the nuttiness is more of um, maybe more like an almond sort of character it's got some of that that black sort of burnt malt character and that kind of goes well with that smoky malt which really you get a lot on the finish that that nice campfire um, not as bacony as some beers that use that type of malt but definitely a nice big smoky finish lingering finish uh, but the beer does dry out, balances out. I don't know, it almost tastes like there's a little bit of um, like a hop character on the end, but I don't, I don't think that's really any hops at this point. I think it's the darker malts just really, really drying out your palate to go along with that alcohol, which you do taste a little bit of. The initial sweetness, I'm picking up more and more vanilla as I go too, coming from those bourbon barrels. And you certainly get the, uh, that, that nice caramelly, um, sort of honey-like bourbon character in the flavor. It's just not as pronounced and that could be from the age of from when this was bottled. But um, I, th I think the smoke malt is, is is intense as well at the end. Might cover up a little bit of the barrel character. But overall, it's got a good balance of barrel character and smokiness and sweetness. What's nice about this beer is every sip is a little different. That's always cool with certain beers. Some beers, or uh, some sips are or more sweet, others are more bitter and smoky on the end, and then you start to pick out some other flavors, some more of those those sort of darker berry notes, sort of that sherry, like nice oxidation character becomes a little more apparent, maybe a little bit of a like a darker sort of blackberry uh, t flavors coming through in the taste as well. So it is a cool beer. If you don't like smoky beers at all, then you would probably hate this beer because there's a good smoke character in the end. Um, but if, if, if you don't mind so much smokiness, I think, you, I think you'll enjoy this one. I particularly really like smoky beers if you haven't noticed already on my channel. So I, I'm enjoying this one. I'm going to go A- minus on Porcine Union Dragon from Clown Shoes. Thanks to Jameson out in Arizona for sending out this bottle to me. The cool thing is in San Diego and I think other parts of Southern California, we actually just started getting clown shoes. So uh, hopefully I'll be able to get new batches of this off the shelf here in San Diego. And uh, I definitely will buy some more. But thanks to Jameson, he sent me two out. Next one I get the age, maybe do a vertical on it. So it's gonna wrap it up. Until next time, please comment and subscribe. Cheers.